the first photo in the monochrome nature section is called trying to down the opposition and it's called 10. It is silver for a five star worker. There is good composition in the photo, good action and the eyes are sharp with a bit of a highlight in them. The beaks are sharp too. Unfortunately, the mono conversion has let you down. The photo needs more contrast and the photo appears to be overexposed and the blacks are more grey than black. Water buck scored 11, it's gold for a 5 star worker. Well done Karen Crook. There is lovely eye contact between the water buck and the photographer and I like the highlight in its eye. The background is out of focus, placing the attention on the buck and the tonal range has been handled well. You can bring your levels down one or two stops as it might be a little bit on the light side. Tusk scored 11, it's called for a 3 star worker, well done Dix Miller. The tight crop works well and there's a lot of detail on the hair and the skin of the elephant. More contrast will enhance the photo. Who are you? Scored 10. It is silver for a 5 star worker. I like the reflection in the photo, but the angle from which the photo was taken lets the photo down as a shot from above does not have good impact. The whites appear to be burned out and there's no detail in the blacks. A landscape crop might also give the photo more impact. Dwarf Mongoose scored 10. It is silver for a 5 star worker. It is a nicely seen photo with a good crop and composition. The eyes are big in the format and is sharp and there are nice highlights in the eyes. But unfortunately the photo appears to be a bit overexposed and over sharpened. Legs scored 11, it's gold for a 5 star worker, well done Lewini Brits. This is such an interesting crop and composition with just the legs in the photo. The first thing that caught one's eye is the different stripes on the legs. Your monochrome conversion has been handled well and the background is nicely out of focus. This is a photo with a lot of impact. Well done Lewini. Leipert scored 11, it's gold for a 5 star worker. Well done Johan Meiberg. The leopard is well in focus and has been placed well in the frame. To crop on the right hand side of the photo would enhance the photo and the background is too distracting. The photo appears a bit overexposed and it doesn't have a good tonal range. The blacks are grey and not black. Young Lion scored 12, it's gold for a 5 star worker, well done Renata Ewald. The light has been handled well. There is a lot of detail and a highlight in the eye. A thin frame around the photo will define the edges and enhance the photo. Owl scored 11, it's gold for a 5 star worker, well done Karen Crook. I like the frame inside the frame of the photo. The focus on the owl is perfect and it has a highlight in the eye and there is a lot of detail in the feathers, well done. Zebra scored 12. It's gold for a 3 star worker. Well done Dix Miller. There is good action in the photo and the action has been captured well with the dust and the open mouths of both zebras. It would have had more impact if the background was more out of focus but otherwise well done. Lacquer Water scored 12. It's gold for a 5 star worker. Well done Robin Dubois. You have used the tonal range well, good blacks and good whites and all the greys in between. The focus is excellent and I like the fact that some are drinking and some are keeping a watchful eye. A tighter crop would enhance the photo. The reflection in the water does not contribute to the overall impact. If looks could kill scored 10 it's silver for a 5 star worker. The eyes are nice and sharp but there is too much of the photo that is out of focus and the white areas of what seem to be the prey are disturbing. It blends into the lion's face and is intrusive. There is too much out of focus vegetation in the way of the picture. This photo called Young Lion by Renata Ewald was voted best in section for monochrome nature. Well done Renata.